This is Pandemic Legacy. I am halfway through season one. Uh, if we look and see my calendar, I have played, uh, I've completed June. Uh, the only month where I did not win was May, where shit got crazy. But I'd like to, uh, basically this game is in virtually no way similar to how it started, and I'd love to sort of recap some of the changes. Uh, first of all, I've unlocked four new characters, Soldier, Quarantine Specialist, Colonel, and Operations Expert. I've unlocked five new actions. I can quarantine... I can do military base flights. We now have military bases. I can build roadblocks for, to prevent uh, outbreaks from spreading. I can pick up equipment, such as a hazmat suit. Uh, I can also search. This is a brand new one that I've yet to even play. There's even like a little sideboard of this search component. Uh, one of the big things is how what used to be the blue disease has evolved. I no longer have blue cubes. I have faded pieces. These are, let's see if we can even like see what they look like. They are almost, you know, zombie-like creatures. Uh... What's interesting about the faded pieces, that they're, they're essentially like cubes, you, but you cannot treat them, so you can never remove them. Also, if they outbreak, say, for example, San Francisco was to outbreak, Los Angeles, Tokyo, and Manila would then become faded cities. So, potentially... You know, the whole world could become this one disease, which would make it, you know, even more difficult. So far, I have yet to uh, have it spread beyond blue cities. Uh, they, what made May so difficult was they introduced this idea that when I'm getting player cards, such as San Francisco that this actually triggers a faded figure. Uh, so it's... Um, <laughs> there, there's sort of an infection component when even getting player cards, not just the infection deck, like standard. So it, it really can spread. Uh, we have green military bases in addition to white uh, research stations. I've opened up five of the eight boxes. Number eight is reserved for when you lose four in a row. And the most I've ever done is two in a row. Uh, you can see I've opened about half of the stickers so far. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it's... My, my objectives... I have to complete three of these, so I, this is mandatory to discover the cures. And so I have a choice of either eradicating a disease, uh, establishing military bases in six regions, a brand new one of finding the virolo virologist, or quarantining seven faded cities, which is really impossible with how they immediately get unquarantined as soon as another card is pulled. So. Uh, that one's... I wouldn't suggest going for that. Uh, yeah, I mean... This is... Entirely engrossing and... Really does have a life of its own.